It's one financial administration four one five zero is one million twenty nine thousand three hundred ninety eight dollars. Okay. Why is my what is my book because say? Because he Okay. Mr. Jones is following the DRA form, which that's includes exactly assessing, right. tax collector, yeah. okay. audit. Oh, that's right. right. From the other from the other night, I yes. forgot. Okay, from last week, we never actually did a motion. The finance department. Yeah. Hold on, Christy. Is three hundred seventy-four thousand. Yeah. Okay. But so go ahead, Tim. Um, yes, he's correct. I just want to remind everyone that we already uh, discussed. Assessing and tax collecting, which is part of financial administration. Correct. And what's remaining is uh, finance department, audit, and MIS. That's exactly right. And we'll be doing those. We'll do the finance. So I was just saying then the we'll do the audit. For all those departments. That's, you want the grand total? And then we'll yeah, because we have to pass yeah. the grand total. And right? then yeah. we'll do the MIS. We have to pass the line item. Okay. One million twenty nine thousand three hundred ninety eight dollars. Thank you. Because I, I don't believe you made any adjustments to any of those other departments the other night. So. No, we did not. So. Okay. Well, we did discuss them, and I just wanted to make. All right. Clear. Does anybody have any questions for Christy about what's on page five, which is the financial administration and also the audit services? Seeing none. Well, I'd like. Christy to speak a little bit about our budget. Oh, okay, go ahead, Christy. Okay. Um, there's part-time wages is down slightly, and that is a reflection of in the 2017 budget, I had two employees out on FMLA at different times, and so we had brought in some part-time help. So that is the reflection there. See what it is. Let me go down with my ruler here. Uh, the elected officials' wages that would be the town treasurer is up two percent for a pay increase that's in there. OT wages is increased based on uh, run rate averages, uh, OT time in the department to get ready for audit. And if there are people out on leave, then some of the full-timers end up having to work extra hours to pick up some of the slack because the part-time that comes in to fill the 40 hours can only work 28. Okay. So that's what some of that OT overtime is. And let's see what else we have for changes here. Equipment maintenance. Equipment maintenance is up 1.77%. And I believe, let me go over here and see. <laughs> That's the software service agreement is up slightly from 2017 for our, our financial software that we use is under that line item. And then we have, what else is up? I pay so much attention to everyone else's stuff. So I know, supplies see. and expenses Supplies and expenses up is up 4%. 4 just to be more, I mean, there's nothing new in there. I think it was, I just put in an amount that was Closer to what was actually being spent on those on that line. There's not. There's. It's just office supplies. It's pretty standard in there. And then um, I've lowered the bank service charges because if you see last year we at 2016 we were at 34,000. Um, this year so far, as of the end of September, we were only at 23,000. So I felt like we could cut that down based on the run rate of the bank service charges. Mm -hmm and brings us down to an overall decrease of 2.28% for the yeah, finance office. Right, I minus 2.28. Okay. We'll okay. refer and then, to it. And then your audit services? Audit services is a three-year contract. Okay, thank I you I think it's much. up slightly. Up um, slightly, yeah. And if you look at the run rate for 2017, it's low because we didn't end up having a single audit. And that 23000 that you see there was only... Um, the first payment we have since made another payment, and I don't have that with me, but we're going to come in a little slightly under budget on that. Okay, thank you very much, Christy. Any questions for Christy in this section, Tim? Yeah. Could you take a look at page 11? Page 11. Under the MIS tab for those who are tabbing away. So we're on MIS? Yeah, Wait. see what it says? See what it says? Total financial administration? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yes. That's a slightly different number than what we just moved on, so. 
Um, uh, That's because the detailed pages always have reflected exactly what was requested. I believe if you look back, the tax collector had a higher increase than what the Board of Selectmen moved forward to you. The number I gave you was the amount that the Board of Selectmen moved forward, which is on your summary sheet in the So front. what did you originally propose for the tax collector's pay raise? I didn't originally propose anything. She proposed something of, let's see here. But you fill out this budget and give it to the Selectmen, right? Hey, but I don't make up the request. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think sure it was 3%. So the tax collector had originally had in... For herself, she had had in $59,391, and the Board of Selectmen brought it back to the 2% that they right. did right. for well, Let me guess. She was asking for a 3%. Three, and then it I went believe to it two. was three. And you put I it have in, to go look at tax. And you put it in, and the Selectmen took it out, to, took it down to 2%, right? right? Just like the right. uh, clerk. Right. right. And that's what changed same, that same thing, right? on page I 11. put in what the individual department Requested. had to give to So that was your motivation for putting in there. The town yeah, treasurer asked for it. If I don't pick the percentages across the board of who to put in for what percentage. No, but the answer is you, you put it in there because the town treasurer asked for it. All right? The town uh, treasurer or the tax collector? Excuse me, the tax collector. Sorry. <laughs> You're getting confused here. I'm Sorry, getting old. It's just that simple. <laughs> slow down. Slow down. So in any case, it explains why that figure is different on it page says town 11. treasurer right here on page 5. I thought you were on page 11. Page and then 11. No, I was looking at page 11 asked, only for the total. I mentioned the tax collector. I didn't mention the treasurer. I mentioned the treasurer when I was talking about mine. Yes, there is a yeah. pay increase in there for the treasurer. <laughs> Of two percent, I mentioned that a second ago. When All I right, forgot to sing the song, turn the page. Sorry. Oh, hold on, Tim. Tim, let's finish one thing at a time. You're jumping all over the place here. Any. Buddy, have any questions about what's on page six, which is the financial administration and the audit services? Yes, I'm talking about page five, which is part oh, of page okay. six. Well, you, we're talking about page <laughs> And that's five. why I'm talking town treasurer. Okay. Well, you skip to the page 11. You went to 11. I always that. said, yeah, I only wanted to reference the total. Okay. <laughs> the treasurer has it. I put in an <laughs> increase for her for 2%, yes. You put it in, and it wasn't changed. It was not changed because it was 2%. Okay. Thank you. That was really simple, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. um, and that's all I have. Well, thank you very for much. For that page. Thank you. Um, okay. That takes care of that page. So now we're going to move on to uh, we've done audit and we've done. MIS uh, now. We're going to do MIS now. And that is on page 10. Okay. And then that will have. The MIS is Management Information Systems. Yes. It's $227,428. And I can just run through the different increases and decreases here. The 6% in regular wages is a result of pay adjustments were, that were in the 2017 budget. There's nothing new in here. It is up 6%, yes. But that is something that was in the 17 budget and approved when the budget was approved. So there's no additional money there. I mean, there's additional money there, but it's something that was already approved. Um, the next thing, if you look down under supplies and expense, no, let's see. The next one that's up is computer support. Right. It's up 19.65%, right. just, um, just under $4,000. And let's see here, computer support If you, it, it is all of the different... Um, licensing and things that the department has and there's just been some increases across there i believe the internet has gone up um comcast i think is the same but just basically some of it, it lists out all of them on page 10 if you want to see exactly what they are but that four thousand dollars is in regards to licensing maintenance contracts things like that that's where that increase is for that item uh let's see here. Replacement, Replacement equipment. equipment is up 20.19% or roughly $7,000, just under $7,000. A couple years back, I think this will be our third year that we came up with an actual um, list of all of our computers and servers and came up with a five-year rotation plan for all of the, those pieces of equipment. And so... Last year, we broke them down into different uh, cat three different categories based on the user. So we have like a basic user, a little bit advanced, and then an intermediate type of user. And all of the users um, fall into a category. 
and on the replacement schedule, depending on which category you need to replace, it could be more money for the next year. So um, in 2017, we were replacing it, for the five years, it was more of the lower end users. And then in uh, 2018, we have some more high, higher end users in there. So it's about the same, roughly the same number of computers and servers and stuff, but they're just different user types. So just trying to be more accurate in what we're doing there. And then the motor vehicle allowance is down 40% uh, or about, let's see, $400. $400. And that's literally just because it wasn't being used. Okay. So I looked at the run rate and cut it based on the run rate. If you're not going to use it, then we kind of have been in the thing. Don't leave it in the budget if it's not being exhausted. So that was adjusted just based on the fact that it wasn't being used. Thank you very much, Christy. Mm -hmm. Anybody have questions for Christy? Tim? <coughs> for uh, this particular thing, page 11. Tim? Go ahead. It's 10 and 11 on the detail part. Yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm sorry, 10 and 11. Yeah. Thank you for correcting me. Go ahead, Tim. 6% uh, on the regular wage increase? Yes. Uh, did each employee get 6%? Uh, no, I believe that they each <coughs> got, I should have brought the 17 budget with me. <coughs> um, they may have each gotten 6 I can't remember what they had had before. I didn't bring last year's budget with me, but it was in the budget for last year. It was clearly marked on the merit line. If I don't know if you have the 2017 Those, uh, budget with you. That line, subline, is uh, up 6.01 percent. Yes. And it reflects regular wages for two employees. Yes. So two employees shared a 6.01 percent increase. Yes. Right. Did they share it equally? I guess is another way of phrasing. They did share it equally. Oh, I do know that. You. Yes. So they each I kind of feel like it was in the four percent range, to be honest with you, but I don't recall for sure. I'd have to look at the um, seventeen budget. The supplies and expenses up six nineteen point six five percent, twelve yes. twenty percent. You spoke to that briefly. Um, I noticed that the biggest sub sub line item in that is actually uh, five thousand dollars for wiring supplies. Under supplies and, supplies and expenses. Yeah. Supplies and expenses. Okay. I, I, I don't quite understand. Are we doing uh, our own wiring now? They've always done their own wiring. I mean, not wiring like dropping like Comcast or fiber or anything, but they do all the wiring, all the buildings. And if they are moving equipment around, just last week at Public Works, um, the new operations assistant I believe is the title wanted to move her desk around so they went and climbed up in the ceiling and dropped the wires down and yeah so yes, they I do mean that's that that's rather stuff. small wiring stuff I mean 5,000 seems to be well, what was rather last high year? I cannot like see I, said, I, don't have the I can't budget. see these from these numbers what's causing or what's driving this 20% increase on the subline item uh, I'm, just, <laughs> I'm just looking at the biggest number and saying oh it's wiring supplies is the biggest number I don't know that that's the biggest increase yeah um, and I guess you don't either. So but supplies and expenses. Is that what you're talking about? Yeah, supplies, supplies and, expense. and expenses. has a 0% increase am I, am as I far reading as the wrong I line? Computer support. Okay, sorry. Oh, computer support. Yeah, okay. and you're saying that's all licensing related? Yes. Okay. And there's been some increases. I know that I can grab some of my backup, but I know that um, the website, the hamptonnh.gov, increased um, from what it was last year. The f I believe, let's see here. I think the other, or the town hall firewall. Um, well, the town website is um, hosted in that room right there, right? Yes, but you have to pay for the um, Hampton and H dot gov. The name? That's like $20 a year. Let me grab my backup before I speak, because I have all of it in backup. I don't know. Mr. Chairman, after we get done with uh, finance, are we going to move right to the Warren article with the technology upgrade? No, we're going to go, we're going to finish this list, and then we'll go on to these Warren articles. Okay. okay. Let's see.
increases from last year for yeah see this has got Hampton NH, this one's got Hampton NH gov yeah it's actually that was 400 last year too so 400 doesn't make any sense to me I mean anybody can buy an internet domain for 20 bucks a year 25 bucks tops so it's not the name itself that, that I think it's licensing with it or something along license those for what lines. you're using freeware uh, for years and years and years I don't believe changed. we're using freeware anymore we are not using freeware they you were using BSD uh, Linux yeah we're not where you um, We're not using freeware anymore. I do know that it's four hundred dollars. I have the invoice right here, actually, for that. Mr. Chairman, if you would authorize me to look into this offline with Christy, and if Christy would assent to that uh, offline, so we can move on. I don't want to bore the committee with all these details. Um, okay, but Tim, if you do that offline. Then I would. If I find the need to adjust, I would I'll do it in final review. I would require a request that you uh, make notes, so of that course. you can come back to this board and tell us, give the conclusions. Sure. How's that sound? Absolutely. Okay. Is that, that okay with you, Christy? Sure. Okay. That that sounds like a good so idea. That'll, that'll, so, I know this stuff can get boring to people who aren't into it. Well, it just happens that I'm into it. So I know. Yeah. Well, there are some of us here into that. Um, okay. Is that it from you, Tim? Regarding this uh, MIS, yeah. Uh, well, other than one question, uh, the, you, you did you do have a warrant article for a technology upgrade. Did that have any the existence of this warrant article? Did it had any influence on the creation of your budget? No. Thank you. Okay. Anybody else? So, what we're going to do now is we're going to move that one million dollar <coughs> figure that. Um, Total financial administration forty one fifty, and the number again, Christy, was one million. Okay. One million twenty nine thousand three hundred and ninety eight dollars. Three ninety eight. Okay. All right, Barbara, did you get the um, that number? I the number. Okay. Who made the motion? Tim. Tim uh, made the motion, and Regina, you seconded it. Sure. Yeah. It's one million, one million twenty-nine just, three nine eight. What? I might have, I don't know. Barbara, did you write down who two, two made the motion and seconded it? Um the motion was made by Tim. Tim, okay. The second by Regina. Regina. Okay. All right. All those in favor, raise your hand, please. And it's unanimous of those present. You might want to note that Tim isn't present. He, he said, said he would vote. Yes. He said he was. Well, we can't do it that way. Yeah. You know, we can't do it. He's got to be here to vote. Right. All right. So now we're going to move.